I know you read the title of this video before clicking on it, and you're probably thinking, But Cook, the Stug is the worst weapon in Warframe, not the Burst, and... Well, if you thought that, shut up! Are you happy with this future? SHUT UP! CARTOONS! I have a video titled, The Stug is the Worst Weapon in Warframe History Already. This is a series on all the weapons in Warframe, particularly the bad ones, and the Burstin is a bad weapon. So that's why we're talking about it. And no, we're not talking about the Prime form. And no, we're not talking about the Incarnate form, which is mid anyway, because I say so, so now it's automatically mid. But we're talking about the base flipping Burstin. And yes, I did just say flipping, because I can't say the F word until later in the video if I want to make lots of money. And for you very special individuals out there who are still saying, Cook, the Burstin is the beginning weapon, so it's not fair to compare it with other weapons, really, since it's meant to be bad and for low levels. Well, guess what, guys? That's a good point. But I also don't care, because this series is about the worst weapons in Warframe, and not about how useful weapons or may, not, may or may not be when you get them. Basically, I'm about to let my balls hang on the Burstin, and oh boy. Are they big? I just addressed. I okay. just addressed what 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 he just said. That's mm -hmm. like I never contradict my because I let my nuts hang. I'm not just stupid. I'm not. I'm. I'm. But before I let my nut sack hang, I actually want to give a huge shout out to Nasho Prime who gives me five weapon slots, which honestly really helps since I mean I don't have. That means I don't have to sell a bunch of weapons every time I want to make these videos. So huge shout out to Nasho Prime for being the sponsor of this video, basically. Also, beyond that, ignore my overly aggressive intro, guys, because I really do appreciate the support recently. Making videos and talking with you guys in the comments or on stream has honestly been an amazing experience, and I'm excited to hopefully keep experiencing it. Sorry for getting like a little bit since the middle there. Talking about letting my balls hang sometimes makes me feel that kind of way. But now let's talk about the stats and the looks of the Burstin and the lore if there is any. Which there probably isn't, let's be honest. There's been a total of like two weapons with lore and I haven't covered either of them yet. So let's just get right into the stats and the looks of Burstin, baby. First off, let's talk about the design of the Burstin, since looking cool is arguably the most important thing in Warframe. Let's be honest here, if the Stug looked awesome, it would be one of the most used weapons in the game, regardless of how bad it is. I mean, come on guys, does anyone watching this video base what weapon they use on how effective it is? Like, I think we all just pick the coolest looking weapon, mod it to hell, and then tell everyone it's actually optimal because it looks awesome as shit. The point I'm getting at is, is that the Burstin doesn't look awesome as shit. It looks dumb. It's like trying to be fancy, but doesn't pull it off because it's only, it only goes like halfway. I mean, look at this thing, it's stupid. Fuck. The Burstin. Burstin these nuts. Anyway, the official description of the Burstin is, The Burstin is a 10-0 burst assault rifle, char char characteristically known for its three-round burst. Honestly, looking at the Burstin stats, they aren't that bad, and the utility stats are actually kind of good. 45 bullets a magazine with a two-second reload speed isn't a terrible combo, and you guys know how much I hate small mags and long reload times. So having a normal reload time with a big mag makes me happy. Imbecile, you absolute buffoon. What you have there is not clips. These are mags. They're mags, not clips, you absolute fucking dummy. The same way that this is also a mag. They're all mad. The Burstin also has five ribbon deposition, which is also pretty good. So far, utility wise, the Burstin isn't looking so bad. Maybe I was too harsh in the beginning of this video. Well, I was absolutely too harsh. I've never even used a Burstin, and I don't know if it's actually bad yet. Alright, I take it all back from looking at the tax stats of the Burstin. They're completely ass. 6% crit chance? 1.6 crit multiplier? I guess we know we aren't building for crit at least. Well, surely the status is probably amazing if the crit is so bad. Okay, yep, 18% is like mid to bad, so the Burstin nearly has nothing, especially when the standard damage of the Burstin is below average already for assault rifles. Anyway, let's go into the first Earth Extermination mission and try out this weapon without mods. Alright guys, I started, those, uh, I started this video before the Lois started talking, so this is what she said. Hey guys, today we're locking in using the Burstin for the first time ever. This is a level 1 to 3 extermination mission, Burstin only, no other weapons. So let's lock in and see how the Burstin is. That's a very specific uh, 
Lotus message. I think she did it because uh, DE has been watching my videos. They love me. I'm the I'm their favorite the uh, Warframe creator. They said so. I think they've been putting in little Easter eggs for me, and they predicted my next video pretty well. Kind of impressed by DE for doing that. They somehow knew my next video. Impressed. Must have been in the stream last night. Anyway, we're using the bursting for the first time here, guys. And guess what? It's not one shot bursting them. So that means it's ass. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. That's what that means because this is level low level enemies, bro. The only other weapons that haven't one shot these people, and a Sug has one shot these people. I just want to keep that very relevant. The Sug has one shot the enemies here. The only other weapon that hasn't is the Kraken, and then the Gorgon. And the Gorgon makes sense because it has like five million bullets in a chamber, and it's a heavy machine gun. And the Kraken makes sense because it's ass. Kraken cult, shut up. I will fight the Kraken cult one on one. Every single one of you, I will fight you back to back to back and win. Fuck, I'll fight you at once and win, bro. Meet me in the goddamn octagon. Cracking cult, okay? You hear me? Yep. Cracking cult, shut the fuck up. Anyway, <laughs> I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. Anyway, uh, the burst right now, I'm just using, I'm getting a feel for it. I like how it feels. There's like not a ton of recoil on the burst. But there's not really a ton of recoil on any weapon in Warframe, so that's not really that relevant. I'm used to that Rainbow Six Siege recoil, to be honest with you. So like, Warframe just doesn't have recoil, if we're just being real here. Uh, but yeah, it, it's not, it's not bad. It doesn't feel bad. Actually, it feels kind of nice to shoot. It sounds cool. It looks cool. The kick isn't that bad. So like, Aesthetically, it's kind of pleasing to be honest. Kind of like how the Gorgon was, but damage-wise, it's cheeks. Obviously, so far as we can tell, it's not one-shotting these enemies. That means it's dog. It just it didn't even one-shot level one enemy. Like that guy was specifically level one. Did not even one-shot. Like what in the ass does that mean, bro? That's like fucking. Let me think. That's like Nicki Minaj signed ass right there, bro. That's like Ash Castle level of blowing. That's how bad this one is. Anyway, uh, we <laughs> bro, I'm kind of funny, guys. What? I would subscribe to me too. Damn, I'm funny, dude. What? I'm locked today. I'm locked today. Just off top like that? Okay, okay, okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and break these open. But yeah, it's not a great weapon. But I like the magazine. The reload speed isn't bad. The magazine size is good. Um, the damage is ass. The sash chance is ass. The crit chance is ass. Uh, looks kind of dumb. I don't like the look of it, to be honest with you. It's like, it's like trying to be simple looking, but also like fancy at the same time. I just don't like that. If you're going to be fancy, go full force fancy. If you're going to be simple looking, just please be simple looking. You know what I'm saying? Like don't overdo it like this thing does, but don't also underdo it as well. That's my opinions on the looks. It's kind of just cheeks. Um, but yeah, that's my first thoughts on the bursting. Because I'm bursting my nuts. <laughs> Uh, I wish it was called Bustin. If it was called the Bustin, <laughs> if it was called the Bustin, that'd be the funniest shit ever. Holy, why didn't why didn't you do that, bro? The Bustin gun, <laughs> that'd be awesome. I would like that. Okay, are we almost done with this mission? Are we locked? Boom, headshot. Yo, remember your favorite Martian? Oh my gosh, you guys remember that YouTube channel? I watched that, watched them when I was like a kid. They did music videos. They had a song called Boom Headshot. That shit was ass. I used to thought that was heat when I was a kid, though. I'd replay that shit over and over again until I like learned what real music was. But like I thought that shit was so heat, bro. You guys remember that? Insane stuff, insane stuff. Can you die? Thank you, bro. Okay, what are these? Heavily armored? Because they're kind of destroying my gun. You guys are not dying at all. Bam. I missed. Holy shit. Yeah, see, it's like it's taking like three bursts to kill a level one enemy. That's the same. Well, I just got one burst there. That's pretty good. Where are you guys at? Where the fuck am I going? Let's go. There we go. Look at all these losers over here. Boom, boom. We're getting kills today, boys. I know I'm, I should probably end the gameplay segment here because now we completed the mission and I've said everything I want to say. But uh, watch time, am I right? Anyway, thank you guys for watching this gameplay video. Now let's get back into the video where I talk about my thoughts on leveling the person. Which will be after I level it because obviously it's not leveled right now at all. I mean, it's level one. Also, I don't have any mods on this. Bye! We are on Telisto Saturn, baby, and we are here to use the max rank Burston after I just grinded in the Cephalon, whatever the show streets are called. To be honest, by grinding, I mean get got carried by randoms, if we're being completely honest here. Anyway, I'm going to be trying to flip them out. Here's the mods I have on it. Yes, they're not great mods. Yes, I only have 30 spaces. Yes, I just went for as much damage as I possibly could. Uh, nothing crazy. This obviously isn't a great setup. And that damage right there was actually surprising to me. This actually isn't bad at all. These are level 20, 23 enemies. Uh, that's not that's not bad damage, honestly, by the burst. Team. It's not terrible right here. It's like I went for a pure damage build. There's like a little bit of slash damage chance, and then there's uh, a little bit of slash, and that's about it. Because uh, you know, fuck it, man. There's not a great slash chance. There's not a great crit chance. So I said I'll just go for damage because I'm not really gonna be modding it professionally anyway. 
it's just a very low mod with only 30 capacity. It does have one uh, mod spot that's already, uh, you know, it's, it's what's called, um, like, uh, the, the type to make it less as a pretty useful type. I put my multi shot in there, so it's actually decent. It has a, uh, a uh, what's it called already in it. You guys know what I mean. <laughs> but yeah, should my mod list. I'll go ahead and show you someone's optimal mod as well. Haven't looked into whose I'm going to use yet, but this is an optimal build for Burson, or at least a good build for the Burson that I found on YouTube that I looked up. So you can use that if you want, if you're a goat. But the Burson honestly isn't that bad. I kind of came in with too much virtue y'all for the Burson because it's not, it feels good to use. Like, don't get me wrong, statistically, it's a dog shit weapon uh, and it doesn't really do that much damage. It's not a great weapon. It's a bad weapon. It's a terrible weapon, honestly. Like, probably bottom 20 weapons in Warframe. Like, let's just be real here. It's probably bottom 20. Maybe not bottom 20, but it's, it's close. It's close. Um, the thing is, though, it's just, it feels good to use. Like, it's just a nice, simple weapon that feels nice. Like, it's not a weird gimmick that feels terrible. It doesn't have, like, low ammo. It doesn't have, like, a low mag. It, uh, it shoots pretty quick. It, the first feels good. It's just not, it's, it doesn't feel like the cracking, which is kind of what I expected it to feel like, but it doesn't. So it's not really a bad weapon. I kind of came in over hating on the, the bursting. Well, mostly for just comedic effect. But it's, in all actuality, using it at max level here, it's not bad. It's not terrible. It's like for the starting weapons, it's probably one of the better starting weapons, to be completely honest here. I've always been a bull, I've always been a huge Bulldor fan myself, so I'd probably say Bulldor is better. You guys might not agree. But like, I, 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 I don't know. It's not bad. It's definitely not terrible. Um, but yeah, it's just kind of mid. It's just kind of mid tier. Uh, beginning weapon, whatever. Who gives a shit, right? So there's not a whole lot to say about it either. That's the problem with the person. Because it's so basic. It's like the most basic thought process creation of a weapon in, of all fucking time, right? Like, there's like nothing to say about it. Because it's just so incredibly basic. It's just actually insane. Do I recommend anyone using it? Of course not. It's a beginner weapon that's kind of ass. But, I mean, if you're starting out the game and you can choose between the Burstin or the, the Bratton or the Bultor... You can make a decent argument to pick the uh, the burst as like your first like left weapon you craft. And it will do you pretty well throughout the game. I mean, look, I'm shredding. I'm not shredding, but I am going through these level 23 enemies pretty easily. I mean, you you, you typically would be using the burst at this point in the game anyway. So I mean, just think about it. If you're using the burst on like level 10 to 15 enemies, which will probably be the peak of what you use the burst for, then you're good to go, right? Like that's just all you need. So it's it's not bad. It's good. For, it's maybe even good. For like the lower levels when you're actually involved in it, but uh, I mean it's just overall it's still a terrible weapon. So I mean, you know what I'm saying, like comp comparatively to everything else in the game. But if you don't compare it to everything else in the game, compare it to like where it's supposed to be and when you'll actually use it, then it's not bad at all. If anything, it's actually a little bit good. Even that's pretty much my thoughts on the burston. I'm not going to complete this whole mission because holy shit, if I just bring the burston with me. It's going to take an hour. Let's be honest here. Uh, this is taking kind of a minute. There's a hundred enemies I still need to kill, and uh, we're not going very fast. In this. We are not. Also, Grenier up here. Yeah, it's, I guess those are my final thoughts on the burst, and there's no really need for a conclusion of this video. I think I like where I do, uh, where I use the first try, then I'll just give my conclusion in the max, in the, the when I use the max level video, because I just don't really see the point of writing so much for these videos and the script, because I mean, I don't think it really adds that much when I just give my, I kind of like reiterate my thoughts. Uh, is that's pretty much it. Maybe seem a little bit like smarter. I mean, if I'm going to say them twice in anyone, I might as well just say them once, even if it's a little bit mid when I say it. So, I hope you guys are enjoying these videos. I love you guys. Thank you for the support recently. Shouts to everyone that was in the stream yesterday. Uh, if this video comes out late, uh, you can blame Kaz, you can blame Elmo, and you can most definitely blame Logo in the comments. They, uh, we were fighting Google Lex and Air Lex decide not to show up ever. And it was awful, and the stream went on for like three more hours than I thought. I was up super late. I wanted to uh, work on this video last night. I wasn't able to, so uh, yeah, I'm grinding out this one the next morning. I got like four hours of sleep. I'm grinding it out for you guys uh, because I do want to put up a video today. And if it's not coming up today, then uh, it's their fault. And if it's late today, it's their fault. Blame all, blame all them. Also, but shout out to everyone on the stream last night. It was really, really fun. Um, and thank you, to everyone who like gifted me shit. Like, thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'll give out a shout out to Nasho uh, specifically in this video. That's because Nasho gave it to me off stream. Like, I was able to say thank you to Nasho, um, like live. So I, I would just want to make sure to get Nasho that thank you. But like, everyone was so helpful. Like, uh, Hollowed uh, Sentinel or Maximus in the comments was he was so helpful helped a ton got me a really good setup for my cedo which maybe you guys will see in a later video so i just want to say just thank you guys i really do appreciate it um 
But yeah, that's pretty much all I have. Let's just beat the mission at this point, guys. Fuck it, guys. You guys are gonna watch some extra gameplay of me farming the brat and brat bursting and doing absolutely nothing with it. Fuck it. Who gives a shit? We're, we're grinding now. We're grinding now. Yes, we're grinding now. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pop my actual abilities here. So I can get <laughs> oh my gosh, I just... I didn't even, I wasn't, how's that have the range that far? I didn't think it was, its range was that far. What the fuck? Whoa, why is the range so far? Is it normally this far? I don't remember that. Whoa, okay, buddy. This isn't even a melee no more. It's a range weapon. Does that hit? That does hit. That's insane. That's actually kind of insane. Let's go. Let's go. Ready? Oh, wait, because it does whatever they're weak to. So if they're weak to radiation, then it's going to do radiation damage. That makes sense. Okay. My, what? Oh, because I have to do this one. Wait, let's, let's go that straight back real quick. I need that back real quick. I need that back. Let me just throw their weapons. Please, I need more strength, please, bro. I, I don't want to use this shit no more. <laughs> I don't want to use this shit no more. I got the care of this guy. He's destroying my abilities. Man, I'm in love with the girls I know. I did not want to use that. <laughs> I did not want to use that already. Ah, uh, where are you at? Where are you at? Boom! <clears throat> Through walls. Let's go. Let's go. Go ahead and move. Go ahead and move. I've been really feeling Baruch. I'm not gonna lie, dude. I'm not gonna lie, I've been feeling that Baruch. I love Baruch, bro. One of my new favorite frames, to be honest with you. Okay, he ran away like a bitch. Nice. You love to see it. Nice. And we should be done here soon. Break this up real quick. Please be done here soon. God, I have to pee so bad. Yes, okay, thank you guys for watching. This is the end of the video. Stay blessed, stay happy. I'll see you guys in the next one. And let me know what you guys think of the person. And if it's ass, if it's mid. Let me know. Peace out. Stay blessed.